I'm in my guest room to give you a review of the Winamo 45 degree adjustable folding clothes rack. As you can see right away, one of the things I find most impressive is the low profile. Also, it's super easy to install. There aren't any installation instructions that come in the box. You have the product, two screws, as well as plastic drywall screw mounts. Luckily, I found a stud and was able to put this up pretty quickly. It did only take me about maybe five minutes. It's really simple to install. I'll actually pull it off the wall so you can see what I mean. There we go. So this is what the back of it looks like. If you've ever put up shelves on your wall, this is very similar. Put the two screws in. You can't see the screw holes after this is on the wall, so you'll want to be precise in your measurements. But I wasn't entirely precise in my measurements, so it didn't measure up exactly right, but it's still pretty close. Because you can't see the screws after this is on the wall, you're going to want to screw these in pretty tightly, but not so tightly that you're not leaving room for the screw to slide up into this notch. I installed it just by sliding on and down, and then after that was on there, if you unfold it, you can kind of see this screw down here, and just tighten that up to give it some extra stability there. And there you have it. Really low profile, not in the way until you need it. And when you do need it, it slides out. It's not, if I push on this, it's not going to fold up. You do kind of have to feed it along. And you'll see when I'm pulling this out, it doesn't go down all the way. I kind of have to help it. Things work pretty well. A little wobbly, but I bet if I tighten up that screw up there a little more, it'll fit good. It'll work well in our guest room because our guest room is not in use all the time. And when we have guests, they'll be able to flip this out and we'll have another place to hang their clothes. Pretty simple, straightforward installation. Even though there's no instructions, just make sure that you're measuring the space between the two screw holes and putting them at the right distance so it's easier to pop that on and slide it down to lock it in.